parents want the best for their babies and food is a really important part of that. Weaning is when we start to introduce more foods into babies, lots of different textures, lots of different tastes. Today we're going to take a look at using butternut squash because you don't need to spend money on special baby foods to do weaning with your baby. So for stage one, we are just going to have a look at the butternut squash on its own. So cook it, you can steam it or boil it till it's really nice and tender. Put some into a bowl and use a hand blender just to smooth it down. You might need to add, you know, maybe four tablespoons of the cooking water to do that. At the end, you want a nice smooth consistency with no lumps, something like a sort of a thin custard. Make sure it's cooled down nicely before you give it to the baby. Then for stage two, we're looking to add a little bit more texture in here, a little more variety with the foods. So we're going to use the butternut squash again, but this time we're just going to mash it instead of using it in the blender. So just mash it up so it still has a good bit of um, texture in it. Then for stage three, we want to build even more texture into what we're doing. So we're going to add in some pasta. And so for this, we're going to use the butternut squash. We're just going to mash it up and nice and smooth. And then we're going to add in some pasta. You can just cook pasta, cut it up into small pieces, and then use a little bit of Parmesan cheese on top. This is the final consistency. So there's plenty of nice texture in there. Just remember all babies are a little bit different. Some might take a few tastes and a few tries with new textures and new flavors to get used to them. It can take up to about 16 goes. 